You recognize this as being a human type figure, right? <laughs> yes, sir. Okay. Um, it's actually got a belly button, right? It surely does. Does it appear to be anatomically correct? For the belly button, yes, sir. All right. So, as the defendant described it to you, am I, is this the way he described it in the area of his belly button? Well, what's really important right now, sir, um, number one, you've got your knees up pretty high in his waist. If you want to slide down just a little bit more so okay. that you're in the air, there you go. Have a squat. I can't see your crotch, but in the area of his belly button. Yes, okay. sir. Well, here's his belly button. Am I oh. in the area? Yes, sir. Okay. Um, by the way, did you have the defendant do this? No, sir. When you talked to him, you didn't have him do that? No, sir. Okay. If, um, if this person, this mannequin, were carrying a firearm on their waist, where would the gun be right now in relation to me? Would be at your left inner thigh. Right here, right? Yes. Okay. If he was right-handed, it would be at your left inner thigh. Yes, sir. Right. Underneath my leg. Yes, inside your leg. Okay. Were you aware that the defendant described to his best friend that um, when he slid down, the defendant slid down, that uh, Trayvon Martin was up around his armpits? Were you aware of that? No, I've not heard that. No, sir. Okay. Well, where would the gun be now? Now the gun would be um, behind your left leg. Okay. May I use your dog for a moment? Of course. Let's just use this for a moment because I want to follow up on some of Mr. Guy's questions. So, George Zimmerman, Trayvon Martin. Were the injuries on Mr. Zimmerman's back of his head consistent with someone doing this on cement? I, I don't think so. How about this? How about somebody resisting the attempt, the injuries, the two lacerations? Could that have come from cement? If somebody was resisting me pushing down like I, this? I, I believe so. I believe it was a culmination of downward force, whether it was from pushing or striking. And I know clearly by the injuries to his face. And that driv would drive him back, his head striking hard into the concrete.